Hello guys, how are you doing? And in this episode, we are going to see how to transfer music, albums, songs and playlists in iPhone from one music subscription service to another. For example, if you have recently got any Apple Music or Spotify free trial subscription service and you like to try them but you are afraid that you cannot take the playlists, albums that you have, you know, downloaded and using in different music streaming services, you know, then this application that we are going to see today will help you to transfer all those playlist songs to these services, you know, wide variety of services that we are going to see today and you can enjoy the same music collections in high definition. So the name of the application is Song Shift. I'll leave a link to that in the description. Also, I'll pin that in the first comment so you can easily find it and download it from the App Store. So this is how the app interface looks. It is very simple and minimal. And on the top, you can see a simple introduction is given, like you can perform a share, transfer of music fast and free without any limits. Of course, they do offer in-app purchases. And these are the available services. You know, only these three services like Discogs, Hype Machine, and last FM are source only like you can export music albums and playlist from these three services but you cannot import from other services so that's what it actually means so we are going to connect two music streaming services today uh, as a first step in order to perform the source to destination transfer of uh, you know few playlists it is very important for the song shift app to get uh, complete access to your music streaming service initially in order to perform this transfer so whichever music streaming service that you're going to select from this menu you need to give access to the song shift so that is the very first step as an example here I'm selecting Apple music and it is important that you already have subscribed either trial or paid version of Apple music in order to transfer in or out you know with the Apple music subscription service they have also clearly mentioned that you can read the instructions and then you can carefully proceed to the next step so once it's done I have already subscribed to the Apple music subscription and then I have to click on continue so after that it will be the connection will be established successfully and then you can uh, connect with the second music streaming service here I'm choosing Spotify I'm going to transfer my Apple music playlist to Spotify in this case so once you read the permissions that the song shift app is going to get you can click on continue to complete the connection successfully so here the two services Apple music and Spotify are ready when you click on continue it will show you the prompt that the free app you know allows you to transfer all these things and if you are planning to go for pro you will get some extra features like multiple transfers at the same time within you know one shift creation so we are going to create a song shift task here in this step by tapping on the plus icon on the top right corner so the very first shift setup is going to be you have to select the shift source you have to select either one, either Apple Music or Spotify, which both we have already connected. Or you can also choose from JSON or text file. Uh, and then you can, you know, you have to select from the top, what is it going to be, either album, playlist or song. So as the first one, I have selected Apple Music and immediately it shows me the list of playlists that are available in my Apple Music subscription service. If I want to do multiple, you know, transfers at the same time within one shift, as I said before, we have to purchase their subscription service. It is somehow cheaper, of course, if you want to support the developer, you can, of course, obviously pay for one month or, you know, buy based on your requirement and interest. So this is the first shift setup. And when you click on add another task, you know, you can simply set up another source either from Spotify to Apple Music or Apple Music to Spotify. So here in this case, I'm going to select Apple Music, another album with less number of songs. And you can see the destination is automatically selected as only we have two services selected uh, in the previous step. So I'm going to select one more playlist which also contains some less number of songs just to uh, you know see how much time it takes when we create multiple shift setup in this section. So as you can see the three playlist transfer is all ready and of course I can add multiple shifts I can add unlimited shifts there is no restrictions to that and once it's done you know I, I have to click on I'm finished on the top left you can see the processing bar have opened and a small animated icon appears to confirm that the transfer is in progress so the gym specials playlist which I have selected as the first one uh, the transfer has begun and within few seconds you know all my transfers have been completed as the number of songs totally were less so here the very important step is 
if there is any missing song or more than one song you know in the destination music streaming service that i have selected it will be displayed in that specific page i either i have to rematch and try to find it or i have to ignore and you know one or two songs that i'm unable to find it in the destination i'm really surprised you know compared to apple music spotify has majority of the songs only two songs in each playlist i was missing but that's all right i think i can handle that you know if i want to listen to those songs i can try with the apple music itself because the playlist on the apple music will not be deleted so here when i open spotify i can see all the playlists successfully you know present and i can continue my music streaming from apple music you know to spotify hereafter so i hope this episode and the app i have suggested to you helped you to transfer your music playlist and songs in your iphone thanks for watching for more iphone ipad mac related tips and tricks and tutorials don't forget to subscribe to our channel thank you and have a wonderful day